stuff, low stuff. Because you know when the girl wakes up, they're like, oh, God, this right now, this, it's just not right. But when I wake up, I'm like, fuck, yeah. <laughs> you know? Do you really? Yes. <laughs> like, when I wake up, like, I don't care how fucked up I look like, I'm like, decent. <laughs> and I walk out. Like, girls, they're like, mmm. Yeah. <laughs> you know, like, we, we don't give a fuck. You know, when we walk out, it's either fucking good or fucking amazing. You know, we have like two things. It's so either, I, like, when you wake up, it's either A or A. Plus. Yeah, exactly. There's never been a day where I'm like, oh, because of the way I look, I don't even want to go outside today. Yeah. That never happens. Sometimes it blows my mind when girls complain about their fat around actual fat people. That's just dumb. Yeah. You never seen that? No. Yeah, that just be like, oh my god, I'm so fat today. Around fat people, that's horrible. Like in the group of friends, or like in a group of friends, there's actual yes. fat people in that group. Yeah. Like fucking Devin, he goes, Ugh, I don't even work out. I just got a six pack, bro. I'm like, I will fucking <laughs> shoot you in the fucking back of the. He's a humble bragger, dude. <laughs> god, you know, like yesterday I fucking did like seven backflips. I was like, oh, it's an off day. <laughs> <laughs> I hope he gets this episode. I hope you're editing this, you fucking bitch! I'll make sure he gets this one. Edit this, motherfucker! <laughs> Humble boy, I could I know, you fucking bastard. What were we talking about? Like fucking Devin, he goes, I don't even work out, he's got a six pack, bro. I'm like, I will fucking shoot you in the fucking back of it. <laughs> I'll make sure he gets this one. Edit this motherfucker. This is your fucking bitch. I'll make sure he gets these nuts. <laughs> Got it. <laughs> Got it. So, you know what I find out? It's, it's also a flavor thing too. I like the flavors. Yeah. Even though when I'm not like hungry and I'm stuffed, I just like the flavor of things. And I just, <clears throat> or like if something tastes like shit, even if I'm hungry, I eat like a little bit of it and I'm like, because if I have a whole bunch of food that tastes like shit, I'll stop. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, but if it's really good, I will eat until I'm about to fucking barf, which is so bad. What's your definition of tasting like shit, though? Mariel once cooked me a. <laughs> she made me. <laughs> Guys, just came out to you about yeah. to end your relationship. Yeah. <laughs> you know what? Talking about her. Wow. You have no idea how much fucking material I have now, because I I've been with her for quite a while, so I haven't been able to put out this material because I didn't want to show people I have a relationship. Yeah. But fuck. Everything's coming out now. So she she made this. I'm not I'm not a food snob, but she keeps on calling me a food snob. But she made me rice that came out like fucking thuck, like rice cake, right? How? And she was just because she put way too much water into it. Uh, How do you fuck up rice? Uh, That's what I'm saying. And she goes, Oh well, I guess for the rest of my life you're not gonna eat my food. Oh, I hate you. And I'm like, Well, first of all, don't feed me garbage, and then I won't. Then I won't. There's a way to fix I it too. I would have poisoned you if I was Muriel. Yeah. <laughs> no, she could have fixed it. She could have just left the rice cooker open, fucking. Fluffed it out, let it fucking air dry. She couldn't fluff it out because it was just one clump of glutinous rice. That fucked up? Yeah. But you know, like, I'm not a food snob, but there's like certain things that I. I well, like. rice, come on. Rice is like the whole meal. Right, you yeah. should know how to make rice. Yeah. But you know, <laughs> I, there's even like lines yes. on the fucking <laughs> rice cooker. Fill up water till here. Does she use a rice cooker? You know what the funny thing is? She cooker. makes really good healthy food though. Like I'm talking about you. Because there's nothing to it. <laughs> no, 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 no. It's you mean the salad and the vinegar like that? <laughs> she made this one thing. It was, I thought it was, it was like some kind of kale pudding kind of thing, but it was green. But it, she made it with soft tofu, and it tasted like 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 tapioca pudding. Wow. But it was like really high in protein, a lot of micronutrients, and I didn't know what I was, I was like, this is amazing. Make me this weird shit. Don't make me normal food ever again. <laughs> yeah, make like, me this weird shit. <laughs> yeah, and it had like flaxseed in there, it had like granola. <laughs> I, I was like, yo, this shit looks crazy, and it was delicious. Damn. She make me this fresh. green pizza. Or maybe you're so used to eating her normal shitty shit that anything outside of the normal, you're like, this Baja! <laughs> it was pretty good, because she like sweetened it with a little honey, and she put a little, um, Cayenne pepper in this, so it was a little spicy. What? It was. It was. That sounds really ridiculous. Good. It's really good. That sounds like some ratatouille shit. It's actually on my Instagram. You can check it out. And I was like thoroughly surprised how much I liked. It. Everything just makes me hungry. But they say for people who have the lack of sleep, their system is really desperate for a shot of energy, so they kind of trigger cravings for sugar carbs, just like quick. That's sleep. you. You don't sleep enough. That's why you always eat gummy bears. No, I'm just addicted. Because <laughs> you never bad. sleep enough. No, I've always been addicted. Because you never slept enough. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> I've known you for six years and you never sleep enough. Well, I've known myself for longer than six years and since I was a fucking kid, I've always loved candy. But your brain okay, knowing fine, yourself you is she not as that. much as my brain knowing yourself. Okay, good. She has the classic, the relationship, like, would you shut the fuck up face? Like, yeah, okay. 
dumbass. <laughs> <laughs> she's like, she completely tuned your ass out like that. She goes, all right. You're zooming. Because every time, she's like, I'm a little bit tired. I should just take a nap. And I'm like, I'm going to take a full hour because I know I'm going to need an hour. She goes, no, I'm only going to need 20 minutes. And we'll, we'll sleep. She sets the alarm. 10 more minutes. <laughs> I know you way better than you know yourself. Ah! <laughs> He's using this based off of yesterday's example and, and what I said verbatim. I said, hey, I would like to sleep longer, but I can only do 30 minutes because I know my schedule. No, you always ask for 10 extra minutes because okay. you never know how tired you really are. But I do. She's already turning them out. You should just <laughs> look <laughs> <just like, laughs> <laughs> Yeah, I'm waiting for Julia to continue. <laughs> Like, you know what ice cream I found out was bomb as fuck? I found it in the, ref in the refrigerator. You didn't find it, it belongs to someone. No, Dean bought it, but then I found it. <laughs> but it's, it's, um, it's... <laughs> it's like you went on an exploration in your fridge. Yeah, because it was lost, and he happened to <laughs> so Somebody else's, you fucking thief. <laughs> so it's mint and chip, but then it, this one's called Moose Tracks. And the reason why it's called Moose Tracks is it's the one you get at Vons. It's like that black, it's in a black container, right? Yes. Yes, that ice cream's good. And then the chocolate chunks are way bigger than the regular. Ooh. It's not little dots. So it's yeah. like kind of gooey, kind of half melted. Ooh. That shit is bomb. Do you like McDonald's? No. I'm yeah! Hey! Yay! Yay! The only time I'll eat McDonald's is like if I'm at the airport. Right. Or like I just, I have no other choice. Yeah, I agree. Thank love you. McDonald's. I love McDonald's. Justin, thank you. McDonald's, if, if McDonald's, oh. if they got their cheeseburgers, right, and they cut it into like eights, and then they put like Jiro sushi next to it, <laughs> and they were both served That's on the nasty, same plate, right? I would... I would be like, oh. You saw that though, right? Where, where, the where they had a, a foodie convention of all these people who were like acclaimed like food like critics, and they took up like McDonald's food and they put it up and they were like judging okay. it like, this is amazing. <laughs> okay. So, I hate to burst your bubble here, but I'm pretty sure those were paid actors. No, no, oh. they weren't. Okay, because we believe everything we see on TV. No, we went okay. on IMDB and okay. we checked all those names. Absolutely oh, true. Okay. But you know what? At my chiropractor's, oh, at my chiropractor's office, he put a McDonald's hamburger in a Ziploc bag and left it there, and then five months had passed, and it looked exactly the same. Awesome! Oh, no! In an earthquake, you know you could depend on Gross. McDonald's. No, McDonald's is the nasty. fountain of youth. You eat it, and you are immortalized inside. <laughs> they always bash on me because I don't like McDonald's. So every guest we've had, they love McDonald's. Give me your money. So I'm so happy you're here right now. You're on my team. Yeah. This is the one irregular guy. Justin, no. Oh. It's a preserve. I mean, dude, it has so many preserves it's in nasty. it. Yeah, because it preserves me. No, it doesn't. <laughs> it preserves the food. It's like eating styrofoam. It's yes. It's like. And what is wrong with that? <laughs> no, don't get me wrong though. I'm not saying it's like doesn't taste good. I mean, Ooh. dude. But you know, if I had a choice between like. Zero and McDonald's, we'd go with. That's Euro. a hard choice. Don't don't put me in that position. It depends on how much money I have at the moment. Because <laughs> imagine a chicken McNugget mm. on sushi rice. Oh. Wow. Ew. <laughs> Musubi! With a little, musubi. With a little oh, fucking seaweed yeah. wrapped around it. Yeah. That's bomb right there. McDonald's brings me so much happiness. Ba -da -ba -ba -ba. <laughs> she was just like disgusted to, to the max. She's like, no, no. <laughs> Because he said it tastes good. He just doesn't like the stuff they put in it. And no. I've said I've eaten it. Yeah, but you said you don't like it. Like, you don't like the taste. No, you guys bash on me because I don't eat all the bullshit you guys eat. Like Bullshit? I bullshit. Hold what on. What a bullshit. A I hate fucking chicken, chicken McNuggets. Gross. Uh. Gross. 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 Fish filet. Uh. Oh, my. I just told you I loved it. <laughs> That's Daniel Staple. Did you say Daniel you're gross? <sighs> you're saying a filet fish is fucking gross. Well, I mean, I have to be really in the mood to eat it. Cause it's what kind of fucking mood do you have to be in? Like a filet fish mood. That's an everyday mood. No, uh-uh. Dude, I'm gonna fucking light your sweater on fire. <laughs> <laughs> Back me up, Justin! I mean... But he likes the taste too, though. Yeah. He likes the taste, he just, just he feels guilty because he yeah. goes, I'm unhealthy. Yeah. But for you, you just fucking hate the taste. I just don't want to get cancer. Yeah. See? Yeah. See, he's he has, our he, team. Has a, he has a rational not, fear. Yeah. You're not. A, whose team are you on, Justin? I mean, dude, I'll team? just be on Gio's team because Yay! I feel bad. I feel bad. I mean, you feel, feel bad. bad. That's a sympathy. <laughs> you got a sympathy teammate. <laughs> really, Justin? No, no, you know what, Gio? I, I, 
You know what, guys? Yeah! That shit tastes like shit! Yeah! You're smiling! I'm <laughs> 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 smiling inside! <laughs> Yo, Chicken McNuggets taste like cardboard! Yeah! <laughs> Tastes like sandpaper. Hey! Yeah, there's honesty in what he's saying right now. <laughs> Thank you. That bread is just too fluffy to be good. <laughs> <laughs> oh, the flail fish bun, dude. How do they make the bun so sweet? Because it's not real bread. Why don't you? You're not real person, dude. Shut up. Damn. What the fuck? Everybody's having a good time. You're bringing everybody down. Fuck. You know, and who who takes French fries and and eats it with soft serve? That's just not. Good. <laughs> that's just that's, absurd. That's pretty good sometimes. That's really good all the time. Sweet and McFlurry with, with french fries, I'll give you that. You fucking freak, dude. Whatever. I am a freak. Yeah. <laughs> These are the different types. Oh, that was like mushroom. The McMushroom? Ooh. Honestly, you know, if a guy gropes you, you should Shut immediately- Shut up, don't say some dumb shit. Kick, kick them in the balls and then punch them in the throat. But it, it must be hard though, like for a lot of girls that like, I'm gonna kill this motherfucker, but when it's actually happening, it's like, oh my god, oh, yeah. oh my god, yeah. this is happening to me right now. What am I gonna do? You freak Dude, out, right? That's me with every situation that, like, in life? life. Yeah, that involves confrontation. I'm just like, oh my god, it's a red light, uh, it's a green light. Oh my god, do I go? Hey, that's not confrontation. See, I get, <coughs> that's why I get so upset, like, at those videos. Because, you know, you've seen the videos where they always tell you, go for the fucking ball. But you always see them like try to pull at the guy's hair. Guys like that shit. <laughs> you're, just, like, you're just helping them out. Like, oh my god. <laughs> oh, fucking yes. just go for the fucking balls and squeeze until it fucking pops. Uh. I want to go for the eyeballs and just be like, fuck you. That's good. That's well, good. I, don't, I, don't, I don't know if girls like realize how sensitive the fucking ball sack is. It's very like, soft. Like, like about a month ago, I was checking my balls for testicular cancer, by the way. Yeah. Right? Uh, what, what happens when you go on WebMD, you start to like, think of your own shit. I fucking hate right. WebMD. Yeah, so like, I was like, I always I have I cancer. I bump on my nutsack, right? Yeah. But it was actually the ventricle tube that... The ventricle tube. Yeah, and I squeezed it, and I was on the floor for a good four <laughs> hours. Because I thought it was a lump. I was like, oh, fuck, I got testicular cancer, and I kind of gave it a little quick squeeze, and I just fell Wait, over. Wait, why would you squeeze it? <laughs> because I thought it was a lump, so I just wanted to... Uh, so I was like, what is yeah. this? And then you kind of roll around like it's a booger. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I did a little too much, and then I was I was paralyzed for four hours. You've had that too? Um, no, I've, I've felt down there and thought I had a lump, but it was just like, it was a tube. It's a tube that connects like your balls yes. to like your... Your um, urethra? Your, yeah. Yes. Yeah, 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 yeah. Apparently it's supposed to be a really hard bump. Right, and you, you and, wow, and what, you know? what threw me off is my like my left tube is like harder than my right tube. Yes, yeah. So I was like, what is the pr is, yeah, is there fucking cancer in my head. ventricle oh, tube? Yeah. yeah. And so I was tripping. I was like, is one extra descended than the other? Yeah. But it turned out it's just one was a little colder than the other one. I just had to wait for it to Damn. drop a little bit, and <laughs> then oh, it stooped wow. down. How complicated your yeah, sacs so are. I, I get freaked out, so I don't want with you anymore. We don't have any of that for our vagina. Like, we don't have to like. But it's a mystery. Yeah, because yeah, all it's just in there. I think mine are the same. Same hardness. Yeah. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> what are we gonna do with your fingers now? We're fucking rolling. Ah! <laughs> I just took Don't this. act like you never touched those before. We were in your mouth this morning. What the fuck are you talking about? <laughs> Freaking out because it's on your body? I know. Hey! <laughs> only here, not here! <laughs> I don't know why they don't do that in LA. Maybe because LA is different from Seattle, because we have guys here that'll just shoot. Yeah. yeah. Nah, I don't think it's a good idea. Stop! <laughs> oh, you got me! <laughs> okay. There's a fucking dangling baby spider right there. Oh Where? shit. You see that shit? <laughs> hey guys, if you made it this far, well go ahead and like the video. Instead of receiving a tax refund in the mailbox, this woman receives a letter from the IRS saying she was dead. Oh, they thought she was deceased. Mm -hmm. Because if, I, I mean, if you got this letter in the mail saying like, you're dead, would you tell people about that? Or would you be like, fuck, I could be dead right now, like. Oh, yeah. Still, you yeah. believe the letter, you're like, I am dead. No, no, think about no, it. No, I don't no, think no, he no, means not that. Not that concept. The idea of knowing that you can get away like with it. Like you're shit. anonymous now. Now knowing that you don't exist. Yeah. And, um, you're off the radar. Yeah. Like, would yeah. you would you tell? Because obviously she told public about it. No. Which they, would you, take? you know how hard your life would be if you're undocumented. Yeah, it'd be hard. You can't I get mean, credit. You I, can't buy. Anything. She knows. That's how she came to America. <laughs> born say, here. Like, um, no, I was just. If saying, anything, like, it'd be David. That's true. I am. He's a queer immigrant. Here. You know what? Life was a lot easier when I was a legal alien, because once you become a citizen, 
you gotta vote. You, you don't have to. I know, I but they always nag you about voting, and then you had to go to the court system for jury duty and shit. You don't when have I to. was a fucking alien, I, I didn't have, I wasn't bothered by shit. Thank you, fuck about me. Did you have to pay taxes? Of course. Oh. Yeah, if you're a legal okay. resident like that, you always have to pay taxes, but I didn't, you know, that whole shit. Ugh. Ugh. Oh, I love my country though. America. <laughs> <laughs> With that being said, yeah. With that being said, I'm not a terrorist. If, if you want to <laughs> die, just burn all your information right now in your undocumented. I don't think it's that Woman easy. Woman meets a man who is wearing her dead brother's face. What? Yep. This is the original face. This is the original face. The guy who shot himself in the. Wow. He shot himself. Fuck. Uh, <laughs> or he got shot. He got uh, shot. Yeah. Okay. Dang. Is this one? Whoa. Oh. And then. Oh my God. Whoa. Crazy! Whoa. I'm, wow. Whoa. Is that what he? Nice. Is that what he looked like before? Like before no. the shot, the Second shotgun? Yeah. yeah. What did he look like before the shotgun? I don't know how what he looked like oh. before. That fool looked like Popeye on the left. This is like he ate something really sour. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> bitter beer face. Bitter beer face. Right? Damn. It looks like three people. <laughs> this is the bitter beer face. Remember the commercial? He looks like the cartoon on the very left where when they put their mouth over their face. Mm -hmm. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Dang. Isn't that crazy? When where's the where's the sister? That's like, oh, that's my brother. Do you guys feel weird if um that was your, like the left was your face and then you got a brand new face that belonged to a deceased person? Oh, no. no. What if it makes me look hotter? Yeah, especially if I look oh, way hotter. What if it does? What yeah. if it doesn't make you look? Hard? Then keep me like sour face. <laughs> nah, I'd be like, mm mm. Pay Ooh. more money to get a better face. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> if you guys could choose, what face would you guys want to have? <laughs> Whose face would you guys? I want to transplant oh my, my face on my okay. face. <laughs> <laughs> Whose face would I have? I like yeah. my face. I like that face. Keep my face. I'm used to seeing my face in the mirror. When I was little, I saw myself and I said, I can't wait till I get older so I could have a man's face. <laughs> what? <laughs> wait, what do, you, what do you consider as a man face? Just more grown up. Because you know how when you're a kid, your face is like a circle? Uh -huh. And I want it to be longer. I wanted like facial hair. I wanted to like, like, you know, <laughs> a man's face. Wait, I don't know. <laughs> Monterey Bay Aquarium, dude. Have y'all been there? Yeah, I went yeah. there when I was a kid. When I was a children. Dope, dude. I just saw two fucking otters. <laughs> <laughs> how cute! You know how they chill yeah. in the fucking floaty areas? Yeah. I just remember seeing a sunfish there. Oh god, those things are huge. I wanna yeah. go, I've never been. Really? Monterey Bay Aquarium is dope. Road bro. trip. Road trip. How far is Monterey? Like six hours? Six hours? It's far. Yeah, it's like NorCal, five to six hours. You know, because of Monterey though, I fucked up really bad. And what? I killed two animals. <gasps> what did you do? So at Monterey Bay, there's also tide pools next to it. I had this big bucket, and I collected How some sand. Everything you do always fucks. <laughs> As a kid, Dog you always try to kill. Let something. me rephrase. I helped a few animals go to heaven. So I got this bucket, and then there's a tide pools, and I collected all these hermit crabs. What you know, the kind of hide, it, the hide in, in the shells. Yeah. So I had a bunch of them, and I put it in the bucket, <laughs> and then they were happy as fuck, and I was gonna take them home. We leave it in the van. I forgot what we did, but it was a really hot day. You fucking piece all of the shit. Her, all the hermit crabs, they all came out of the shell because it got boiled. <laughs> and then I was like, oh fuck, that fucking sucks. They all died. I, I went home. I think that month I also got a readier slider. And then so I had the red ear slider and I had it in another aquarium and I was like, oh, you know what this guy could use? Some sand. But then I forgot that this is ocean sand and it has salt in it. So I put all the sand in the turtle aquarium and it changed the salinity of all the water and now the turtle died too. You're <laughs> you are straight destruction, dude. Dude, if I had you as a child, I would, my dad would have been like, that's a Satan. Yeah. <laughs>
<laughs> Everything he touched a die. That's yeah. a safety. I just felt How are you still alive, Gio? Dude, I'm telling you, internally I'm probably fucked up. But look at Tyson. I'm not having Tyson's any kids. Tyson's 15 years old now. Because the rest of the life that he lived was with me, oh. and I was like nourishing him back to hell. That's, That's true. true. I believe Tina's it. Tina's awarded $45,000 in damages after a cop arrested her for not dating him. <gasps> what? What an asshole. Well, that kind of happened to me. Wait, shouldn't that be It happened what? to you? Yeah. Yeah. That should be pedophile cop news. Why? Oh, because she's a teen? teen. Mm. Wait, how did that happen teen. to you? She could be 19. Um, so I was in downtown LA and I made a left turn because certain streets, there's certain hours that are blocked off where you can't make a left. Oh, yeah. I didn't know that. I was lost. Downtown LA can be slightly intimidating because there's so yeah. many one-way streets. Yeah. So I'm like, oh shit, okay, I need to make a left on the street. I made it. Immediately the cop pulls me over and then he just like, he, he's like, you know, you know, you're not supposed to make a left here or whatever. And he's like, wow, you look really nice. Like, where, where are you headed? You know, are you did, he, did he have cop talk and then he turned to normal person yeah, talk? Yeah, yeah. That's weird. Uh, <laughs> yeah. And then, uh, and then I'm like, I'm so sorry. You know, like I, I didn't know I wasn't aware. And he's like, oh, okay. And he's like, well, where, where do you, where exactly do you work? Uh, you know, I could, uh, visit you or whatever. And I'm like, oh, oh I'm like, um. You know, I work in so-and-so, and I'm like, but, um, uh, no, like, I, I have a boyfriend. He's like, oh, okay. All right, so then he started writing the ticket. I'm like, what? You should have played into it. <laughs> <laughs> you busy at any time. I know, I'm an idiot. I'm a big too loyal. <laughs> That's so tight, though. I'm like, how but this how much power you have, yeah. though, just from your looks alone. Because the moment I roll down my window, I get three tickets. <laughs> <laughs> like, well, first of all, your back lights out, he smashes it, and your mother down is flat. I'm like, yo, what the fuck, man? You just look like a criminal, you fucker. You should have. Oh, I should have played changed. into it. Like, immediate, like, just fucking cold. Like, all right, well, here's your. I'm like, motherfucker. You should have played into it. That's horrible my bad. He's just a horrible human being. He just felt bad. Yeah. As a person, he's a piece of shit, though, so. Yeah, yeah that's what I got. Uber hires Asian Avengers to offer free rides to passengers who can't afford taxis. What? They just like, free event. rice, you said? They just throw rice out the window? Wait, wait, are what? you serious? Hold on. We gotta figure this out. So Uber. what are we talking about? Asian Avengers. And what did he say, though? They throw rice out the windows. <laughs> so you didn't hear anything about Uber? <laughs> Uber hires Asian Avengers to offer free rice to free rice to free rice. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Uber hired Asian Avengers to throw rice out of the window. <laughs> <laughs> it's fine. Except, it. all right, rice. We're sticking with the rice. Wait, what? So, they, so Uber and rice would never go together, go but to Uber and rice goes together. All oh, rides. 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 We all heard rides. That's a good one. I heard rice. He always does that shit. Like he makes it completely complicated. I'm like. How does that even work in your oh, brain? Dog says human. Who fucking shot who with the bullet? <laughs> Why does somebody's arm get chopped off? No, but he'll make a word up. So he won't say bullet, he'll just say like, what do you mean Zulit? I'm like, what the fuck is Zulit? <laughs> fucking dumb. I'm just have a big heart to give you the benefit of the doubt. Yeah, whatever. I don't want to correct you on the spot. He just hears mad gabs in real yeah, life. Yeah, real. Know. He's mad gabs. <laughs> that is what it is, mad gabs. That's why yeah. he's good at mad gabs. Because yeah. mad gabs turns into real yeah. sentences. If you don't know what we're talking about mad gabs, check out this video right here. It's not going to add on. Fuck! Christian anti-gay protesters accidentally promote hardcore gay porn site. <laughs> That's fucking hilarious! Yes. How did this happen? Hell yeah. You accidentally. <laughs> That's so stupid. So they actually stupid. bought the domain and they linked it to this hardcore gay uh, oh, porn yeah. site. That's awesome. It's called scaryfuckers.com. <laughs> Scary fuckers. Oh shit. <laughs> so it's like guys in jail. Oh, wow. Yeah. That fool looks scary. <laughs> and a fucker. Scary fucker. Damn. Enter it. Enter it. You want me to go on there? Enter it, see what happens. Alright. I'm okay. <laughs> no! <laughs> I'm curious. Can you imagine? Have you seen that picture of the two cholos? In the bathtub? Look into my eyes, Issa. Oh, yeah. <laughs> what you looking at, Issa? Your eyes. Well, Scary let's see fucker. when you enter. Let's see what happens. Oh, 
like getting, he's getting like asking like. Turn that shit off. Oh my please. god, that's a. Did you see the penis with the fucking metal rod in between it? Turn that shit okay, off, please. I think that was enough. You asked for it. Don't act so appalled. I didn't know it was gonna look like that. No shit. What do you think? Were you expecting some titties and a pussy? What are you talking about? I thought it was gonna be a guy in a jumpsuit and another guy in a jumpsuit just staring at each other like they're about to fuck. I didn't know the fucking no, dick was gonna be a fucking regular porn site or a guy on girl porn site. Will you ever see a guy to go like this? No, he had his dick in his mouth and he cummed all over her shit. That is awesome. That guy's dick was in his asshole. Well, that's yes. what happens. I just wanted to experience it with you guys. <laughs> Interesting. Yeah, so in between the times is when the best is when it's the best time to drink coffee not like right when you wake up But then that's with the assumption that all your conditions are on point, right? Like you had not you're like eight hours of sleep and you're eating healthy and you're all that Regardless if you woke up or slept late or whatever the time that you wake up is when you get that Hormone because it helps you wake up Got it. But then it's like if you drink got coffee, it, drink coffee, it, drink coffee. Got it. Drink coffee, drink coffee, drink coffee. Got it. Now you get dependent on having more and more to- In justice yeah. news, villagers spend nine hours beating up dog thieves. Yay! Nine hours beating people up? And then beat up the police when they showed up to take the thieves away. Why? Wait. What? I thought we did this news before. This is in China, right? This is in China, but it's a different. Oh, wow. It's another it's one? They didn't beat up the cops, though. They oh, beat up the damn! Yeah, that's oh, tight. Crazy. China's changing the stereotype. It was like, oh, Chinese people eat a dog. They do, but they also have villagers that beat the fuck out of the dog eaters. Mm -hmm. How come they beat up the cops? They also beat the cops. Yeah. Beating up the cops, that's kind of weird. Because they wanted to probably beat Continue them to death. beating the Yeah, beast. and then the, the cops were probably like, no, we got to do this the cordial way and put oh, them through yeah. the justice system. And yeah, the villagers like, shit. fuck no. So you steal my dog, you eat my dog, I eat you. Yeah. Let me break down the story. Break it down, Julia. Break it down, Julia. Around 7 a.m. <laughs> Two men were caught red-handed with two dead animals they believed that they were killed for me. Then the angry mob gathered and take the matters into their own hands where they savagely beamed the guys and then hung the two dead dogs around their necks. So it was like, hey, that looked like my friend dog. And sexy time news tip. <laughs> okay, that's enough. <laughs> I had to commit, man. No, you gave me the roll. Apple's new iOS 9 wants to track how often you fuck or have sex. Okay. Here you go, Gio. I wanna. Don't look. Don't look. Just. Go, go. What did you get? Damn. You gotta open it. It's a box within a box. This is a determinant of school. Oh, that's pretty look tight. That's the Arnold Schwarzenegger. I know. There's a mouse pad in there? How are you metal if you're liquid? It doesn't make sense. Come in. How many times do I have to kill you? Come in. <laughs> what is that this? Was I know. Dude, that looks match. like a bad. I fucking got the wrong one, dude. What is yours? T1000. But what is it? Do? <laughs> it does nothing. It's just a skull. That looks cool. <laughs> it's like fucked him up in the lava. <laughs> So it's a Haskell model cyborg <laughs> noggin. Highly detailed. That's why. It is highly detailed though. What is this really from? Heavy. It's like oh, I can shit. Shit. That one. With a gun. That's a mouse pad. Da, 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 da. <laughs> that one is a glow in the dark circuit gadget pouch. It's glow in the dark. Let me see. Oh, Turn that shit off. That's Turn off the damn stickers light. Stickers too. Turn off the light. <laughs> It doesn't fucking work! Oh, because, you know why? Because it hasn't been out in the oh, light. You, you can kind of see it a little bit. It hasn't been charged yet. You gotta get those yeah. photons charging, dog. Yeah, it says, charge it under direct light for a couple of minutes and watch it glow. Yeah. Blue Malnessence, motherfucker. I was actually in a car accident that that exact same thing happened. When my mom was driving. And, like, she was trying to make a left turn. Same thing, she didn't see, or the car didn't see her making the left turn. The car just hit us. That's the mother danger. I oh, know. That's what happened to us. 
You were making a left turn and then this car uh, T-boned us. And then you cried afterwards because you thought I was going to get hurt. And then I was like, oh, <laughs> you're you're gonna I was bring like, that up. oh shit, she loves cry. me. You cried? You love him. Pop it! <laughs> <laughs> the first thing she thinks about. No, I thought I was going to fucking kill you all. Pop it. Did you say it? Did you say it? Like... <laughs> what was that? Oh, so funny. It was so tender, dude. Yeah, yeah. Whisper it, just whisper to him. <laughs> just it's relevant, it's relevant. Do it, just do it. Dude, you guys are fucking assholes. Continue the story. <laughs> we're still waiting. <laughs> well, we're not looking. Mobile. Mo you. Don't ever swim too far out of the corner. Hey! First of all, we were in Hawaii and she he was he was snorkeling a little bit further out and he didn't come. She was like, <laughs> oh my god! I never seen anyone chew their nails. nails. She was chewing her nails. You were like chewing nails. Like a cartoon nails? character yeah. that's nervous. You know how they got da, 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 da. Like a fucking nails start chipping in the air. She was like, oh. It was so funny because both of you guys were egging her on and yeah. made her even more nervous because she was like, fuck, what is that actually happening? Oh, no. Because we're like. Oh, bro, no, he barked. He probably saw a shark and wrote it out yeah. to the middle of the ocean. And I was like, I'll go look for him. And I just went and started snorkeling. And I'm like, Eric, bitch. Oh, shit, turtles. Uh -huh.